What's up, guys? A Aaron here, back with another potentially potential YouTube video. Uh, these are a little bit different. I'm gonna kind of tell you uh, what's going on in my head when I play the game. The school of warships that uh, Flambass did, kind of. So I'm a little buzzed, um, done with studying. But the first thing I always do is check the board. Uh, so we're in a legendary tier. Uh, one destroyer divisioned up with a John Bart. So keep that in mind. If you see the John Bart spotted, then you should see the uh, most likely that destroyer spawn on our side. So keep, something to keep in mind. The legendary ship spawned. Oh, we have two. So the grocer on that side in Alaska. Did I see? No. Uh, but right now we're in, a, we're in a light cruiser, light cruiser in our Cleveland. Uh, so I'm, I'm just posting up behind this island. Uh, I, I really like this island. We do not have anybody spotting for us right now. Um, Gladstock's kind of chilling. So we might have to change positions. Can I speak tonight? Positions. Um, especially if we see this cap being being taken. But right now this this position is is kind of. You know, position one if you're in a light cruiser, and he's kind of spamming, you know, even a heavy cruiser. Heavy cruisers might be able to peek around this island, kind of show their bow, or maybe trying to peek and get a spot on somebody, but, you know, in a light cruiser, especially Cleveland, you'll take the full penetration even through the front. It's almost better to be broadside, as I've said in many videos. Nice. We got Yamato on this side, which is actually freaking perfect. We're gonna test the salvo. We're not detected. We're just gonna light him up. Let's see what the auto aim gives us. We get the 4.5 second reload on that. We already lost our destroyer, so that's something we need to keep in mind. Went into A. Yamato's slowing down. And, uh, we're not detected, so we're just gonna keep bombing him. Put out a fire. We, we might push up to keep the fire on him. If he backs up, he'll be out of our range. Uh, but right now, he's, he's made a critical error of going out here without really having anybody to spot for him. Those cruisers might be doing some spotting, but uh, battleships should know this island. So he's backing up when you name in the back of the ship. We got a permanent fire in the front. She looks like a double. Now the only damage we're going to be getting is from a fire. All the rest of these shells are going to shatter unless we hit the Navy top of the superstructure there. Yeah, that is some damage. Switch targets for one second. fun we can have with the uh, the guns there. Looks like he no, he's still is he still burning he's still burning but not from us. Right now we're just kinda of playing with the throttle to, to keep uh, position on this Nagato or Nagato Yamato. I've been drinking some, some some beers. Looks like the destroyer is back in Bravo. I'm gonna go ahead and push up try and remove our uh, so again the enemy team is the difference between a good a good destroyer player and a bad destroyer player all, all stations reporting the position the motto should be dead him. Thanks for playing. Should have got an arsonist for that. We need to be careful of the ships in front of us, but at the same time, we really want to kill this lightning. He's probably being radared right now. Not sure what. Okay. Thanks. Alaska with us. 
Uh, we can actually bow tank these cruisers. Um, switch to AP if we can get any like amazing broadsiding shots on these guys. Uh, but in the meantime, we'll try and cap this point, and then also, as soon as that guy's smoke is up, we'll go murder him. I could radar right here and see where these guys are, but it's not, it's, it's not really worth it. Switch back to HE, because this guy is uh, spotted. We can try and lead him. We can shoot over. We're radared right now. Baltimore wanted to know where we are. That's fine. Baltimore and Wichita cannot penetrate us through the front, even though we are a light cruiser. The Alaska should be able to take care of these guys rather, rather easily, but in the meantime, we're just going to go ahead and back up. Uh, Wichita would have been detected, so we know he's not out there to our left. Try and get some angles on this Baltimore. And right now we have AP loaded for the simple fact that if we catch one of these guys broadside, it's gonna, just going to be absolutely devastating. Uh, these are six-inch six inch guns, uh, but they still pack an incredible bunch. Actually, we're going to swing the guns on this side and turn this way, get an angle on this guy, push around, hopefully kill the rest of these cruisers. Alaska's doing all he can. This way. Not sure where that Wichita went. Did we die? He must have died and I wasn't paying attention or I'm a little buzzed. So yeah, we need to go ahead and switch to HE. We're going to get behind this island before this Baltimore can get a shot. This gun's loaded, might get a shot, but yeah. Um, what that did is it, one, distracted us, got a firing angle, two, um, took some fire off of the uh... now we lost the island okay so a couple shells made it over there no they didn't ghost shells love it so we should yeah, we turned into the shells and we slowed down as you can see they deflected He's still giving us a little bit of an angle. He put out that fire. No, he didn't. As you can see, we actually haven't even taken a point of damage. He just hit our turret with his AP, but uh, we can deflect his shells. Problem solved, sir. You know, for everything except for uh, the superstructure there, the turrets. I really should. Yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and switch to HE. It's kind of futile. See, last got the kill. Should have switched to HD a lot sooner. The ship is on fire. All stations. Reporting the position. Wait, did I? Uh... Charles Martel might have the speed boost active. Something else you need to be wary and aware of is like what ships have different. Hey, Cask. No worries, buddy. I just invited you. Got the Citadel and Hepper. I didn't know we could Citadel Hepper, but I guess we can. Right now, we're just charging these guys, closing the distance. Um, I'm not going to win in, in a gun battle against these guys. They have bigger, more powerful guns. We do have faster firing. wasn't paying attention to. Need him to... This guy's dispersion is... I'm gonna 
turn wide here. Yeah. Charging these guys gives us uh, the assured win. We can ram one of them, do a lot of damage. Prevents them from getting the caps as well, while our team can clean up the other kills there. Also decreases their firing angles. It's a clean 100,000 game. Solo cap, kill here. Uh, that's all you can ask for on a light cruiser. I mean, you're, you're, you're not really going to win against these guys one on one unless you get the RNG fire chance. Uh, but you will. Hopefully, we tricked him into switching into AP. Yep, nice try. She did get a penetration on us. Not sure how, but. There's the fire. We're gonna go ahead and turn back, decrease the angle now. So again, another penetration. I'm not sure how we got, but we got the fire. This is the last guy. Just shooting HE right now, superstructure. Potentially get a fire. Thanks for playing. That's how you light cruiser guys and what was what goes on through my head through most games. Uh, yeah, it's first on the board. Not really a great enemy team, but uh, I don't really care if they're that great. We lost our destroyer right off the bat, um, as you can see. But, uh, we got top on the board. That's kind of how to light cruiser. 386 target hits. That's a shit ton of target hits. Uh, you know, not too too much damage and too many kills, but again, I'm sick and tired of these high damage. Cracking games where they're stealing kills. This is what you should aim for every single game. And if anyone in the comments, yeah, yeah, thanks, Cask. If anyone wants to argue with that in the comments, be my fucking guest. But I got first on the board, 2,600 experience without a premium ship. Well, I guess there's no premium bonus anymore. But yep. So uh, that's the video, guys. Thanks for watching. Thanks for attending the School of Warships Legends versions. Flambas, Flambas has the uh, the PC version. Yeah, that's going to do it. Thanks for watching, guys. Make sure to, if you liked it, make sure to like it. The video, subscribe for more content. Have a great day, guys. Peace.